What's up everyone, Hevi here. If you've been watching the channel for a while, you know that I've been talking about corporations increasingly adding Bitcoin to their balance sheet in place of some of their cash reserves. Well today, I want to explore what kind of effect that has on their stock price. A few companies have added Bitcoin to their balance sheet in various amounts, and for some of them, this has been extremely beneficial to the price of their stock. Today I want to talk about which companies have added Bitcoin, how much they've added, and what effects that's had on their stock price since they've begun adding the Bitcoin. And I also want to talk about how some of these companies actually act as almost a Bitcoin ETF. The first company I want to talk about is MicroStrategy. MicroStrategy has been the leader in Bitcoin acquisitions so far among companies. MicroStrategy is a NASDAQ traded business intelligence firm and has added over $1.1 billion worth of Bitcoin to their balance sheet since August. They are currently sitting on over 70,000 Bitcoins at an average price of $19,000. The current value of all those Bitcoins, which were acquired for about $1.12 billion, currently sits over two and a half billion. MicroStrategy is currently sitting on two and a half billion dollars worth of Bitcoin. And this is a company that only has a $12 billion market cap. As I mentioned, they began their purchases in August and have continued purchasing through January. If we look at the chart, we can see around the end of 2020 and especially into 2021, as the price of Bitcoin rallied, the price of MicroStrategy stock has rallied similarly. It's up over 550% in the last four months, which has rewarded shareholders and executives handsomely. Another company that has followed suit, Marathon Patent Corp, has also added a significant amount of Bitcoin to their balance sheet. Marathon, like MicroStrategy, has seen an explosion in their stock price recently. And lastly, I wanted to mention this sort of de facto Bitcoin ETF. Basically, the two aforementioned companies, Marathon Patent Corp and MicroStrategy, are loaded up with so much Bitcoin that the price of their stock has an extremely close correlation with the price of Bitcoin. If you look at Marathon stock and MicroStrategy stock, compare that to the price of Bitcoin, you can see that when Bitcoin goes up, MicroStrategy goes up. When it goes down, MicroStrategy goes down. So if you're looking for a way to get exposure to Bitcoin without actually having to like set up a wallet, you know, go on Coinbase or go on Robinhood, you know, to buy the coins or anything, and you don't want to trade futures, then you can just buy shares in these companies and you will effectively be getting exposure to the Bitcoin price. Additionally, one share of MicroStrategy currently sits at about $1,250 per share. This is about 136th the price of Bitcoin, so it's a much cheaper way to get in. So to recap, there's a direct correlation between a company's stock price going up and their acquisitions of Bitcoin. We've seen this with two companies, Marathon and MicroStrategy, and now we should be seeing it with Tesla coming pretty soon. So that's all I have for you today. Thank you for joining me in another episode of Cold Plunge Every Day Until Bitcoin 50K. Special shout out to those dedicated likers that have liked almost every video that I put up. Thank you very much, it's well appreciated. And let's get on out to the pool and go for our cold plunge. Well, another day and Bitcoin's still sitting under 50K. So here goes crypto cold plunge number 23. So the current air temperature is 32 degrees. And Bitcoin Bob, what's the pool temperature? Thank you, he says it's sitting on about 46 degrees, holding steady from yesterday.